So yeah, on Friday, I sent the email to DeepMind and on Monday morning, I came into work, you know, opened my emails and suddenly saw this email from Catherine at DeepMind. And sure enough, there was these beautiful three-dimensional structures of every single sequence I'd sent to Catherine. And it was just incredible. Plastic is a great material. The issue is how we deal with it at its end of life. And we're really bad at that. So we really need solutions. Here, we take enzymes from the natural environment. We bring them into our laboratories here, and then we try and evolve them to do different jobs. And the one that we're really focusing on at the moment is enzymes that can digest polluting plastics. So we're in the biorecycling laboratory. So we've taken the enzymes that we've made next door. We've brought them into this laboratory and this equipment here allows us to add the plastic fragments to the enzyme and we're breaking them down and recycling them right here in real time. Enzymatic breakdown of plastics is really low energy, uh, it's really environmentally friendly and it allows us to recover those building blocks and infinitely use them over again. And that means we can stop relying on fossil resources and reduce plastic pollution. The work that we do, it's really essential to understand the protein structure because the function of an enzyme is so tightly linked to its structure. So when we know the structure, we can look for more enzymes that maybe have those shared characteristics. So the holy grail of protein structure determination has been able to take the 20 amino acid letter code, put it into a program and get the 3D structure back. This is where AlphaFold comes in because that's exactly what it does and it does it really quickly. Previously, it took us months, years, sometimes impossible to actually get a structure. But with AlphaFold, now we can do it in literally minutes. So instead of doing one protein at a time, we can now do hundreds or even thousands at a time. Entire PhDs were made on solving a single protein structure and now it can be done in minutes. Everybody's reaction around the lab, and especially mine, I think we were all really shocked. We are studying to be these structural biologists and fixate our careers on these protein structures. And now a computer program can do that. You know, scary at first, but actually the fact that we can work almost collaboratively with this software, it will actually further our science. It took us quite a long time to go through this massive database of structures, but opened this whole array of new three-dimensional shapes we'd never seen before that could actually break down plastic. It's a complete paradigm shift. We can really accelerate where we go from here. And that really helps us direct these precious resources to the stuff that matters and ultimately reduce plastic pollution. <laughs>